Hi everyone, it's Matt Carter here. I want to record this video to show you a cool tool that I've been playing around with. I've been meaning to use this tool for a long time actually and being busy with lots of projects. I haven't got around to it till now. It's, I, I first heard about this over a year ago, um, maybe more, and you know, about time I got to use it. But anyway, so here, um, here it is. It's called Crazy Egg. Crazy and then egg like you fry. Uh, what you're looking at now is my blog. What Crazy Egg does, it is a heat map, so it can tell where people are clicking on your website. You install a um, certain little bit of script that you need to, and with WordPress it actually has a WordPress plugin that you use. You just upload the plugin, and then uh, it's as simple as that. It's really easy to use this thing. And then you just let it run for a certain amount of time. You know, you can either to a certain amount of visitors or you can let it run for a certain amount of time like as in the uh, days so this I've only just set this up in the last 12 hours um, and it's done about 200 visitors so I'm gonna leave it to run for a thousand visitors um, but or it might have been might have been set up even less than that anyway the point being you can see that where all the highlighted spots are here is where people are clicking. The brighter they are, the more they're clicking. So you can get some great information about how what people think of your website. So I found this really interesting when I just looked at it now. So I wanted to record a video and share it with you guys so you guys can use it. Now you get a free trial of this thing for I think 30 days before you have to pay. So if you don't, you know, if you don't think it's useful, then um, don't pay. Don't don't keep paying for it. But give it a go. Um, but what you can see is what people are doing on your website, which is pretty cool. If I let's just look at it from here. If I look here at the top menu, people are obviously clicking on home, um, me, they want to know about me. Definitely clicking on my products, is a, that's even brighter. So that's interesting to me. They want to know more about what I've got to offer. So, you know, I better make sure that page is done well, because a lot of people are going there to that page. They're also going to the resources, and lo and behold, they're not interested in my privacy policy or my disclaimer at all. So do I really need those on there? Probably not. I probably should put those down in the footer, just to make sure that they're on there. But that's they're a bit of a waste of space, really. Um, contact us. Probably gets, it gets a little bit. Maybe I'll put that on the footer as well and just have those. But massive amount of people are hitting the free video coaching, which is interesting. What I do need to test, though, is the conversion rate of having a different form here to, to test that. But it's converting quite well. Um, but they're, they're hitting that. Now, what the other thing I found really interesting, obviously, you know, they, read, they want to read the posts, which is great. Um, but look down here at the categories. Look at the brightest category is SEO. So that tells me a lot about the people that are arriving on my site. They're very interested in SEO. Most of them are clicking SEO or affiliate marketing. So I've, I can tell a lot of what they're interested in. So you know that immediately tells me if I want to please my customers, more SEO stuff would probably go down reasonably well for the traffic that I'm getting and affiliate marketing stuff as well. As well as some drop shipping and copywriting, I found this really interesting. You know, copywriting especially. I didn't. I don't do a lot of posts on copywriting, but maybe I should do more. Uh, and a little bit on and social media, obviously, is getting more. And then WordPress. And I found it really interesting these categories. So that immediately tells me what sort of content I could be producing on the blog moving forward. And obviously, I want to let this run a lot more. You know, over a thousand visits or more, and get a more accurate picture and have an, have another look at it. But it's just interesting when you have your categories there, what they're actually looking at. Um, so that was pretty cool. Um, people clicking on the banner ads there as well, and further down, ClickBank and my blog role. A lot of people are clicking cl ClickBank. So again, that gives me an indication they're obviously interested in in ClickBank. Um, so I, f I found this really fascinating, and then they want to and. The good thing is, people are clicking older entries, so a, you know a decent amount of people are reading through my blog and you know, keep wanting more because they're clicking on older entries, which is good. Which is good to see. So immediately, I can get some great information from Crazy Egg, this tool. So I'm going to let it run a little bit longer and just see what the results pan out with over you know probably a thousand visitors, and then you know I can get some good information to. Uh, to change my blog, or not not necessarily that there's anything terribly wrong with it. It's just giving me good information moving forward on things I could do. So it's a great little tool, very easy to use, simple to set up. Um, you guys could all be using it really quickly and find out what people are doing on your blog, on your websites, and um, see what information that you, you can gain from it. 
So I hope you found this video uh, useful. I'm going to uh, stop this video now and post it for you guys. Bye for now.